It's my birthday. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> How old are you now? 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 Hip hip. Wait, wait, what? We forgot. The house. Mommy has to be. Have to. Let's see, Mommy. We have to talk. To Okay. <laughs> you need to say how old are you? And I'm 33. We, we need to get a cake for mommy. Yes, please. Can okay. I come with you? Yeah. Can I come with yeah, you? later we'll go get the cake for mommy. Okay? Okay. Alright. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Baba. This is for mommy. Be good, ne? Lately my thoughts got me distant Darker days filling up darker minds Stuck in this room that keeps spinning Wondering how you been, where you hide Late night drinking, wishful thinking What if you were here? So guys, I literally just wanted to show you guys the weather. It is so gloomy outside. Like, just look at those skies. It is so gloomy. It was raining last night. It is so cold. But yeah, it is what it is, I think. Um, I am deliberately trying to prep, like, pep myself up and not go with the weather because the weather is so miserable. Hello? I ran away from heartbreak. Got nothing in return for my pain. Wasn't looking for a lover. Hey loves um welcome back to my channel um it's my birthday and i know i started off this vlog in the morning getting ready and everything but time caught up with me today has just been quite a day but yeah we look cute i did my makeup a little wig um i actually had to shoot content for brand which is where it got away with me and then i also went to go get some birthday nails um i did these Hopefully you can see them. It's like mermaid chrome nails. Um, kind of sparkly. Super cute. Like I really, really do love them. I'm at Auntie T's house. Something is going on. Um, so something is going on. I was told to come here. I can't go to my own house. And I'm very nervous because I don't do well with surprises. 
my camera battery is flashing let me vlog on my phone hi guys so yeah um something is going on something is definitely going on i don't know what but people are being dodgy and shady but yeah let's see let's go after my birthday and <clears throat> um i was unpacking the dishwasher because we had like people over for dinner and stuff and then what happened yeah yesterday the last time i spoke to you guys was yesterday when i told you guys that i was suspecting that something was going on because and dt was acting kg but also my husband was also acting kg so um he cooked and he bought some balloons, lit some candles, we sat in the fireplace, we snacked, we ate, we drank, and we just chilled. It was like chilled vibes. And I'm very grateful for that because I'm a very anxious person and I don't do well with surprises. Like, um, it would literally make me so anxious. I got flowers and I'm about to arrange them. My only issue is, I've only got one vase. My other vase has, it has um, the corks from the champagne and MCCs that we were drinking. It was like kind of a decorative thing. So I'm going to try arrange, it's two bouquets. I'm going to try arrange them in this one vase that I do have. I don't even know where I'm going to put this thing. Like I have no idea where I'm going to put it, but I'm going to find a spot for it. 
it is so cold like if you look my nose is so red and also i did these these are not individual lashes these are the lashes from um lash life um very easy to put on i'm still struggling a little bit but i think with practice i'll get better but it literally looks like i've got individuals on and they're so cute um i slept with my wig on and yeah like i actually managed to sleep with my wig on kind of did a mini refresh earlier on um but yeah i want to talk to you guys i'll probably do it like later in the afternoon because i need to do a beat and um finish off a reel what is that in my yard oh no it's the neighbor's yard what there's a dog in my backyard guys i don't have a dog So, um, I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit. Um, this week has been hard. This week has been so hard. And very funny because it's, the, it's like the week preceding my birthday. A person should be excited. But I was feeling very quiet, very withdrawn. I was feeling very lonely and isolated um i think I, what i was feeling was also the last kicks of a dying horse which for me was grief year 32 was not easy for me at all it was a very difficult year i experienced a lot of loss especially in the friendship department i lost people i didn't think i would have to you know do this life thing without and it was very hard for me but yeah, I wasn't I wasn't really excited about my birthday. I'm not gonna lie to you. Um I wasn't excited. Um I didn't actually want to do anything for my birthday. And when I woke up I decided that I was going to get up and I was going to shoot content, which was a very big mistake because now I feel like um I bit off more than I could chew. I was doing too much. But I'm glad I did because, you know, looking good was really, really a mood booster regardless of how, you know, miserable the weather was. And my day was great. It felt really good um, to, you know, celebrate. All I did was I went to get birthday nails and I did a pedicure at Opulence Nail and Aesthetics. Um, but in the process, I met some amazing people. So I made, uh, I made a link up. I, I hooked up with a fellow content creator and influencer who lives here in Bloom. His page is amazing. He is such a beautiful spirit. And like, I was really, you know, taken aback because he was there, um, taking pictures and, you know, like, and I was like, I want that, you know, I don't want to be ashamed about being a content creator or i don't want to be socially anxious or worry about having to pull my camera out i just want to do my thing like he was doing i also met the owner of opulence nail and aesthetics and she was also in interested in starting a youtube channel for the salon and you know and in that moment i realized that sometimes you call for things that feel uncomfortable and i've never seen myself as an influencer content creator um only because i don't i don't look like the other girls that are content creators and influencers i don't do what most of them do you know like i'm not i don't know I, i'm not on trend if i can say that and sometimes that gave me anxiety to say well that probably means i can't enter the spaces that some of these people are entering or i'm not going to get the same view viewership numbers and i'm not going to get the opportunities for brand deals because i'm different but i think this experience yesterday was it was affirming for me because one of the things I prayed for for 33 is that I'm going to be me, I'm going to show me, 
um, I don't want to be afraid anymore, you know, I don't want to be afraid of showing up on camera and doing a full body shot and someone's going to have something to say, you know, let me not worry about what they're going to say, like I want to be, I don't want to be worried about, oh, tucking your belly, oh, you know, they're watching, no, I just want to be me, I want to be comfortable, I want to be able to do what I want to do, I want to try new things, um, I also want to invest in being a content creator and um, like take this thing as seriously as I possibly can and yesterday was confirmation for that prayer um, I prayed I prayed um, for this new year and I cried as usual I cried I woke up at four o'clock in the morning and I cried because wow it's been it's been a rough year but I cried because you know, God led me through it, God helped me through it, and as emotional as it was, um, it was just, like, you know, I got through it by the grace of God, and this year will be better, we're praying it's going to be better, um, and to little me, I think finally yesterday I, I had a conversation with the little girl who was hurt. The little girl who had been traumatized by her upbringing, the little girl who had suffered so many traumas. And I had the conversation with myself to say, baby, you are doing so good. I have been in therapy working through those things and it was finally time to release those things. It was finally time to say, I'm not the victim or I'm not a victim. I'm a survivor and I can be Alyssa without, oh, but this, you know, oh, I was bullied, oh, I was there, I'm just Alyssa now, you know, we've dealt with those things, are still dealing with some of them, but those things don't define me, my trauma, my experiences don't define me, and I shouldn't be lugging them around, it, it's high time I put them down and say, you know, I'm Alyssa and I'm rediscovering myself. Um, what I like, what I don't like. I'm learning certain things, you know, and I shouldn't be afraid to explore those things, you know. But yeah, um, a happy birthday to me, Alyssa Endley, and I wish you nothing but blessings and prosperity. I wish you open doors bigger than you can imagine. I wish you opportunities. I wish you the most extraordinary brand deals. I wish you love. I wish you laughter. I wish you happiness. And I pray God gives you all the desires of your heart in his way, you know, according to him, not according to your expectations, because anything I can ask for, expect from God, it's always going to come in exceedingly and abundantly. So yeah, I wish you the best of the best. Happy birthday, my love. Here's to 33 years of grace. Hello, my loves. So I am just here to do two things. And those two things are to say thank you so much for watching this video until this far. Well, three things. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video until this far. Thank you so much for all the birthday wishes and the kind messages and the prayers and the blessings. I felt special on my day and I really, 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 really am so grateful. And I am going to now announce the winner of the skincare um, hamper from Standard Beauty. So what it has is... I've included a hyaluronic acid serum, I've included vitamin C, I've included a retinol serum, a very low grade because I'm not sure if the person already uses retinol or not. And then I've also included 10% uh, zinc and niacinamide, so you're getting four serums. And that lucky person is, drumroll please, Baadile M. Baadile M. I'm going to put your name on the screen. Please do hit me up on Instagram if you have Instagram. If not, um, leave me a comment anywhere on any post on 
my youtube videos you can post on any video leave me a comment there and then i will make ways of contacting you so i can get your address and we can send you this gorgeous hamper congratulations guys i am still going to announce the winner of the hair giveaway hamper in a different video and i am thinking about giving away something else but stick around stay tuned thank you so much for your support i love you guys so much thank you thank you see you in my next one